How to Find Amber Hello! Today, you will learn how and where you can successfully find amber. We are at the Baltic Sea, and we are now going to the beach to search for amber. Today, you will experience how you can find many pieces of amber on the Baltic Sea beach in one day on the Polish Baltic coast. We got up very early, and it's very calm now, although there was a storm yesterday. The storm has left its traces. At the black spots, you can see that there might also be amber under certain circumstances. The storm also washed up millions of shells. There can also be amber underneath them. Here, someone has obviously built a shelter from branches to survive the storm at night, to be the first on the beach. This also increased his chances of finding the ambers first. To find the amber today, no tools, no kasha, and nothing are needed. Because the Baltic Sea is now very cold, there is also a high probability that the amber will be washed away. We finally found a slightly larger piece of amber. Here in this rubble, you can always find small pieces of amber. Oh, there seems to be an interesting spot too. Let's check. Finally, a larger piece of amber that waited for me. It's also a nice spot. We will surely find a few pieces of amber there. At this spot, the ambers are floating towards us. Also, a few tires. Obviously, others like the spot too. From this driftwood, you can see that this spot is relatively fresh. There are also seagulls to be seen again and again, and at such spots, there can also be amber. On the East German beaches, you occasionally find pieces that look similar to amber. But they are not amber, but phosphorus. Phosphorus is very dangerous because the pieces start to burn when they dry in the air.
If they are picked up and put in your trouser pockets, they start to burn and can cause severe burns. Because it is difficult for a layman to distinguish between phosphorus and amber, it is better to put the pieces in a bag that you can discard if they start to burn. The phosphorus comes from old incendiary bombs that were dumped in the Baltic Sea after the Second World War, and now the outer cavities are rotting and releasing the contents. The amber search was successful. I will show you the results in a moment. Before that, I wanted to draw your attention to our other films. Here you can see how you can process the found pieces of amber yourself. Grinding and polishing. You can find the link to this video above or in the description. This is the yield of the day. We went to great lengths to line up the ambers. I wanted to present to you what can be found on a winter day at the beach. That's exactly 428 pieces found in eight hours. That's 60 pieces per hour or one piece per minute. I am very satisfied with the result. We cordially invite you to visit our Amber Museum. The Amber Museum is a rare and fascinating attraction in Nuremberg, especially for Amber lovers. For our viewers, admission is free. On this occasion, you can acquire a beautiful souvenir in our attached Amber shop. A wide selection of attractive pieces of jewellery from our workshop can also be found in our online shop. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. We are happy to produce more interesting films for you. Thank you very much.